Hello and hey. welcome to Animal Kingdom. Today we wanted to come because they're doing something special for annual pass holders. So they have little things here and there. We definitely want to ride the safari. Oh yeah, definitely. Um, and we're gonna get some lunch too. So come join us. We just took our photo at this spot because it has Kevin and Russell, Matt's favorite Kevin, character. Kevin's my favorite character. <laughs> Every time we come, we always have to look for our friend over here. Oh yeah, the pig. Yes. Here it oh, is, wow. the Balbarusa. Oh, they did. Oh my gosh, they've grown. Oh, Whoa. I didn't know they got that big. So we're trying to figure out if this is the same one that we've seen before, but it might be different. But either way, it's a lot bigger than last time we were yeah. here. And there it is, our first look at the Tree of Life. I love this park so much. I like that one. <laughs> yeah. It's so fun seeing the different animals. I feel like I see new ones every time we go by. Anywhere. I know. And it looks really pretty right now because all of the flowers are in bloom, as you can see. And then Matt pointed out this red tree over here. I'll show you guys. It's beautiful. It has some giant red flowers on it. We're going into Island Mercantile see what they have. Yeah, let's go and see. Are you in the hunt for anything special, Matt? Yes. What? I need to get an Animal Kingdom shirt. Oh, okay. I love the Disney pet merchandise that they have right now with the dogs and the cat. So cute. Look at this that they have. And it has Lady on the back from Lady and the Tramp and it says, life is a walk in the park. Oh my gosh, that is adorable. Matt, did you come in here to get these with yep. Kevin on them? You caught me. <laughs> This is cute though, it says wild and free. And then they have this one too. And then the Kevin Lounge Bar. I love that Kevin's getting lots of this? love. Grape soda? Yeah, it's got a little grape soda cap on it. That's cute. I like that. I like the tank top, it has little grape sodas on it. All right, Matt did not find his Animal Kingdom shirt yet. Not yet, still on the hunt. I do like this one with Safari Mickey on it. I kind of like cute. it. I just don't like how it's dark blue. Yeah, that might be hot. Yeah. That's a hard thing though. Not Most t-shirts are a darker color. This tends to hold in heat. Yeah. Stepped over into Pandora. We're gonna head over to Satuli Canteen to see about some lunch. They have really cool bowls there. Kind of like create your own bowl. But right now we're just taking in the view. The view and the sounds. So beautiful. It's like, this is my favorite part. You know, it's yeah. a slow day when it's a 25 minute wait at the Flight of Passage. All right, so we got our order in and we're gonna pick up between 1.30 and 2. While they're preparing our food, we're gonna walk over to Africa and do something. We don't know. We don't know. <laughs> Just do something. I hear characters coming. Let's see if we can make it in time. So we have Chip and Dale and Goofy. <laughs> I love their outfits. Oh my gosh, look at Goofy. He's pretending like he's rowing his boat. Huh. That's clever, Goofy. Remember the last time we came here and we brought our margaritas over here? Yeah. It's a quiet little spot for today at least. There's nobody. Keep in mind we come on a weekday, so it's right. a lot lower crowds on the weekdays. Here come Minnie and Mickey dressed in their safari outfits. They look so hey, cute. What's that over there? It's some of your favorite adventure loving friends sailing down the Discovery River. Okay, that's a new thing that they say now making our way back to get our food, and the band's about to pass by. They get so that. close to you down here too. Yeah, they do. This is like the best spot to stand and watch. We've been watching characters go by and oh my god. Yeah, there's nobody. They're amazing. Here. Look at these little ducks. They're both hunting for something. They both ducked down really fast. They both dove down together. They both what? Did you see that? They both, duck, they both ducked. Ducked down. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't mean to say that. Come to Disney World and watch ducks. That's what we do. I can smell the food. Can you smell? Yeah, I can <gasps> smell my chicken. <laughs> yeah, it really does smell like grilled chicken while we're walking to it get really our food. <laughs> All right, time to pick up our order. You want one of these? Yep. 
Just to put them at the wall. You could be like Hawkeye, Pandora. but his are much shorter than that, I feel. You're like who? Hawkeye. Oh yeah? Yeah. Oh, those are arrows. Those are like spears. Uh, are so for my bowl, I got the chili spiced crispy fried tofu, which is gluten free. I also got it with the salad base. This is the hearty salad, so it's got lots of veggies. And then for the sauce, I got the creamy herb sauce. And for my bowl, I'm doing the chopped wood grilled chicken with the black bean and rice base. And I also got the creamy herb sauce. This looks delicious. I've had this so many times and I love the crispy fried tofu here. And I think that they may use a rice flour or something like that, but they do have dedicated, fry dedicated fryers here if you have an allergy. And then here, they put my dressing on the side. Um, so I'm just gonna put a little bit of that on top. So there's cucumber, lots of really good vegetables. There's kale. This is a really good mixed salad because it has lots of different types of greens. It's delicious. All right, Matt, you want to give yours a try? Sure. So I like to mix it up. Yeah. I just kind of like stir it all up in the it's like inside. A, it's like a Chipotle bowl, you it know? Is. Like it a really build your is. own bowl at Chipotle. So you get to pick your meat, your protein. All right, all right so I'm going to get a bunch with everything on it. Get me some chicken. There we go. Mm. It's good. Are you glad you got the grilled chicken? So glad. So I've been craving this flavor for such a long time. So, okay, so when you're walking around Pandora and you're close to the Satuli Canteen and you smell that smell in the air. That it's like grilled, a grilled. Yeah, that grilled fire kind of smell. That's what this tastes like. Mm -hmm. So if you want that smell, that it, it's almost like um, the summer smell, like that grilled food and mm -hmm. everything. That's the chicken. Yep. Highly, highly recommend that. And try the different bases because it all goes together really well. Even the greens are good. I oh, like yeah. the greens. The greens are great. I was just saying, I wish that the greens and the beans and rice would be like kind of intermixed. Yeah, it would be really good if you could have a little bit of rice, a little bit of beans, yeah. all of it together. Put it together. all together. It's yeah. all, it all works. Yeah. I don't know if I mentioned this, but there's quinoa in here too. Oh, really? So it's a, yeah, it's a really good blend and there's cucumbers and tomatoes, cherry tomatoes, but really good. I loved it. I love this. I, mean, I feel like Animal Kingdom just has the best food. Um, oh yeah, for sure. Top to bottom, from quick service to right. all the way down to table service. Tons of variety. Uh, Flame Tree Barbecue has lots of barbecue if you like that. Oh, um, the ribs. Yeah, Matt. We loves need to ribs. go to the. Yeah, we need to get some ribs sometime soon. Um, just so many different places here that you can choose from, but we really like the um, Santoli Canteen here. Yeah, we do. All right, we are finished, and where to next? Uh, I think we're gonna go Everest. Everest. Or Safari. Both. Yes. All right, let's go. This is the answer. <laughs> I have to pop in and see if my otters are here because I love them so much. My little otter friends. Look at him. Yeah, he, no. Look at how cutie. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. They're so cute. These are my favorite. Are they gonna go on their fly? <laughs> oh, that is so funny. Aww. You're too cute. You can ask Matt, my number one thing that I said when Disney was closed during the beginning of the pandemic was, I just miss the otters. Yep. I just want to go see the otters. I just wanted to see your otters. <laughs> I love them so much. Yep. All right, we're heading into Africa now. All right, as we go through Africa on the way to Expedition Everest, Kilimanjaro Safaris is only 10 minutes, so we're gonna go ahead and take one. What is your favorite animal to see on the safari? Ooh, I good question. I personally love to see the lion, because I always yeah. love to see what they're doing, the lioness, um, and the elephants. Elephants are my favorite. So let us know in the comments what your favorite animal is to see on the safari, if you've been here, or what's your favorite animal, and Look what just happened. Wow. All right. Well, that's perfect timing because we're walking through a little building. <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. What's your favorite animal? Huh? Um, I think I like the lion. Yeah. Just because at one time we were on it and it roared. <laughs> That was a super cool experience. Yeah. And then another time I rode it, uh, the elephants were playing in the water. I remember that. Which I will never forget that. That was yeah. so cool. Yes. Yeah. But I'm not gonna say the same as you. I'm gonna say the cheetah. Oh, 
lions and cheetah, yeah. Because it's always kind of hard to find a cheetah. Yeah, they're really hard to see. And we are just walking through this line. There is nobody here. This is so strange. But I'm not complaining. No, I'm not complaining. <laughs> Hello. Two. All right, thank you. was a fun safari even though we didn't see the lion or any of well Matt said he saw one as we were coming around the corner but I don't think we caught it in yeah, time. Yeah when we were looking at the flamingos I could see the lion mountain area off in the distance and I saw a female walking and I was like oh I hope we get there in time. Well we didn't. We didn't. <laughs> yeah she laid down. Yeah when we got to where the goats are they were all staring in the same direction and they were all looking at this giant hawk or yeah. something like that. But that was kind of funny. That was hilarious. <laughs> that was fun. Seems like we've reached the end of the day when no one's here. This is so empty over here. There's Mickey. You see him? All right, now to Everest. Everest. Well, Shannon's over there getting a photo. I wanted to point out that this lookout uh, right here, this little relief in front is the exact same shape as Expedition Everest behind it. So we decided to not ride Everest because yeah. it's kind of a long line and... I feel like everybody else had the same idea. Yeah, I think everyone did and it feels like everyone rushed there yeah. and it was very crowded so we decided to just keep walking. Yeah, take a rain check. <laughs> yeah. They have this for Raya. Look how cool. That's just sand, right? I think it is. Yeah. If you look at the bottom, it looks just like regular wet sand. Whoa. Oh, they have wow. um, an animation experience right now for that over in the conservation. conservation station. That's cool. We just came into the store and look at these. That is so cute. The new emos. Remember I had the one with the Ahsoka outfit on? Look at Mickey and Minnie. They have Kermit and Miss Piggy. How adorable. Look at these outfits. Oh my gosh. I love the overalls right here. And look at this one in the hat. <laughs> These are so cute. Oh my gosh, Matt, look. Yeah, I noticed that right away. <laughs> look at this Stitch Crashes Disney series. Oh, I didn't know about that. This is, he's pizza. I was pizza. just gonna ask, did you know about this? <laughs> look at the meatball. It's every third Saturday of the month is what that says. Oh. Oh my gosh. And on the foot, you can see it says 2 of 12. Are you serious? Oh, so 2 of 12 clutches. Look, missed one. He, no. has, he has a meatball in his head, Matt. That's adorable. They have the Dormouse Wishable from Alice in Wonderland inside of the teapot. And I do not collect these, but he's coming home with me because it's the Dormouse. They never do this. Look what else and look at have. this. Oh, we're getting that too. Oh, it could be. It can be any of these. Any one of these four. Oh, no. Okay. What do you think it's gonna be? Um, I really hope it's Alice, but say, I will take the teacup too. I'm gonna say Cheshire Cat. All right, we are headed out for the day, and 
we did some damage. I'll show you guys Just what we got bit. in the car. <laughs> but I, I think I went a little bit stitch crazy. All right, I'm home now. Here's Maestro. Say hello. Say hello. You hear him grunting? <laughs> Um, but I wanted to show you what I got because I was gonna do it in the um, Parking lot because they were closing and I didn't want to stay for too long um, But first of all, I got this reusable bag, which I like the one at Animal Kingdom I don't know if you guys can see it, but um, They have these at all the different all the parks, but I really like this one uh, at Animal Kingdom I like all the animals on it. Matt got this t-shirt it says wanted and it has a child on it. We've seen this before um, and he kind of has talked about getting it uh, back and forth and so I just went for it this time. Um, I think it's so cute. I love the child. Anytime I see the child anything, it's just adorable. Right when we walked in the store, remember that lounge fly that I saw with Angel and Stitch on it? I had to get that. Look at how pretty this is. I love that it has I don't know if it's coming up okay now you can see it um the light pink with the rose gold and then the straps are also light pink i actually saw this at disney springs and i think it came out around valentine's day so um i don't know how much longer it'll be in the park so i wanted to grab it before it's gone if you look up close you can see the hawaiian flower in the background um kind of printed in a light blue i just think it's so pretty um, and I had to have this. I just think it's adorable. And because they had those two new emos sticking out of the, the bag when we walked in the store, I had to get Angel and Stitch new emos, especially because if you missed the, when we were in Galaxy's Edge, I had the Mickey dressed as a Sokotano, which was created by Ashley Eckstein. Well, I saw a couple of um, new outfits that Ashley designed and I had to get both of them because one is the Cheshire Cat, and the other is the Queen of Hearts. So I got both of these that Ashley Eckstein created. She loves Alice in Wonderland too, um, so I'm gonna put these on them because I think that'd be really cute. And then, <laughs> I never do this. I never get this much at, when we're at Disney, but for some reason, these just caught my eye. They had the Dormouse Wishable, and it's in this teapot, and I don't collect Wishables. In fact, I've honestly never even really looked at them, but I had to get that when I saw it. And then next to it were these bags, and they have a surprise Wishable. So it's either Alice, the Teacup, the Treasure Cat, or the Mad Hatter. And I was trying to feel <laughs> to see what they would be. Okay, I think that this one's gonna be, for some reason I just feel like it's gonna be the Treasure Cat. Oh, no. Oh! <laughs> it's the Mad Hatter. Look at his tongue. Hold on. <laughs> that is so cute. Oh my gosh, and his hair. Oh, look, and he has the thing in his hat, too. Okay, that's cute. That's really cute. So I got the Mad Hatter. And let's see what this one is. Um, this one, I think... I'll go with Cheshire Cat again. I think it's gonna be the Cheshire Cat. What if it's a Mad Hatter again? I didn't think about that. Oh, how cute! This is so... <laughs> it's a teacup, but look! It's like, you can sit them in it. <laughs> so it's like they're riding in the teacup. That's why it's called the attraction. Sorry, I'm looking at Matt. These are so cute. I never, I've never thought about collecting these wishables, but if you guys collect them, let me know in the comments because I think they're really cute. Okay, then the very last thing that I got, honestly, is because of the cast member working there. <laughs> well, not because of the cast member. He told me about it, but I saw a couple and they were buying three of these and they went to separate registers and I'm like, why are they buying these? Like, what's the big deal? What's going on? And it's what we showed you guys we thought that this was pizza on Stitch, but this is actually part of a collection called the Stitch Crashes Disney. And Matt actually showed you this. He said he saw, he read the sign on camera. And what it is, is every, was it the third Saturday? I think so, yeah. The third Saturday of, um, of each month, they're gonna come out with a different Stitch Crashes, a movie, and it's all about the, um, or it's, it goes along with each trailer that Stitch crashed when Lilo and Stitch came out. So when the movie released, but he would crash different movie trailers, so he crashed Lady and the Tramp, and this is spaghetti and meatballs. See, he has spaghetti, you can see the texture. 
on his head and a meatball and pizza sauce and then little basil leaves <laughs> and the tablecloth and when the cast member told me the story i was like okay well i love lady of the trip that's one of my favorite movies which is why we named our first dog lady and i also really love stitch because he's just so much fun so i had to get this and now am i gonna have to get all 12. i feel like now that i have this is two of 12. i missed the beauty and the beast so much i googled it in the car when we were on the way home and it's beautiful but it's on ebay for 200 dollars. so i guess this is a big deal maybe that's why there are people in front of us buying multiple um but i'm not gonna sell this i'm gonna keep it because i think it's adorable but now i think i need to start collecting them all which i have no idea what we're gonna put these but how cute is that don't don't you think that i need the rest of them now i need all the stitch crashes i think the next one that comes out i saw on the disney website is um the lion king which is really cute so it had little grubs on top of his head <sighs> so i don't know what i've got myself into now i have wishables and stitch crashes and what am I gonna do with them? Stop and look at them. Most. And Remos. And all these. <laughs> I'm just gonna look at them. They're really cute and they make me happy, so. I mean, it's definitely something that Disney gets you and hooks you and tells you, okay, there's gonna be another outfit next month that you need and another character that you're gonna have to collect just like this and just like the Wishables too. But then once you start, you can't stop. And that's the problem. So, I'm now, I have a problem. I have a problem. I have a problem. <laughs> Think he's ready for me to go and give him some attention um but thank you guys so much for hanging out with us today at animal kingdom it was a lot of fun but yeah thank you guys for hanging out with us if you have any collectibles that you collect from disney let me know what they are in the comments and also let me know if you think that i should start getting all of these stitch stitch crashes see if i can find them all um but yeah thanks for hanging out with us today if you like this video give it a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe and i'll see you really soon bye